Hi, welcome to Mathematics. In this video, we want to solve for y in 40 to power y equals y. Let's say solution. We have 40 to power y equals y. So from here, we can introduce natural logarithm to both sides. Introduce natural logarithm to both sides. So if you do that, you are going to have uh, lin 4 is to power y equals lin y. From here, we recall that uh, if we have lin s is to power m, this is equals m lin x. So applying this to this, we are going to have y lin 4 equals lin y, right? So we can easily divide both sides by, by y here. So we have divided by y, divided by y. So and, uh, it's obvious that this, we cancel out this, so we have then 4 equals then y divided by y. So this is the same as then y divided by y equals then 4, right? All right. So we then apply the Lamban function on both sides. So, but before that, let's recall that. Recall that whenever we have uh, the Lampan function of x times exponential x, this is equals x. So this is a general expression. So let's create the exponential in the above expression we have here. So we have remember we have we have what we have lin y divided by y equals length 4 but uh, let's create like like i said we want to create exponential in this and to do that you know that this y whatever we have uh, exp exponential lin y is equal to what is equal to y because this exponential we can't use this length so we can replace exponential lin y we can replace y with exponential lin y and uh, this will becomes lin y divided by exponential lin y equals equals lin 4 right so if you cross multiply here so we are going to have uh, lin y multiplied by exponential minus lin y equals lin 4 you know this is a negative index so that uh, you are going to simplify it you are going to turn this minus to one divided by so and if you apply it you are going to get this back so now let us divide both sides by minus one so that uh, the base and the power will be the same to be able to use uh, and apply lampan function so to do that we will have uh, then y exponential minus then y then divided by minus 1 equals len 4 divided by minus 1. So we have minus len y multiplied by exponential minus len y equals minus len 4. So it is easy for us to now introduce the Lamban function both sides so if you introduce the lampant function of both sides we are going to have the lampant function of minus lin y 
multiply by exponential minus the y right so equals the lampant function of minus lin 4. So by applying the lampant function so I, let's know that uh, the lampant function of x times exponential x equals x so we have uh, if we apply it we are going to have you know we have the base here minus lin y and we have the power here so we are going to have minus lin y equals the lampant function of uh, minus lin 4. so here if you divide both sides by again by minus 1 so at least just cancel this uh, minus so we have minus lin y divided by minus 1 equals the lampant function multiplied by minus lin 4 divided by minus 1 you know this minus we cancel this minus so we will have we will have lin y equals minus the lampant function of minus lin 4 so if you look at this you know that for us to get uh, um, y we must get rid of this lin and to easily do that we cannot divide both side by lin so rather we introduce exponential on both sides so now introduce exponential to both sides and if you do that we are going to have exponential in y equals exponential minus the lampant function of minus lin 4 right so like i said this exponential we cancel this lin so we will left with y equals exponential minus the lampant function of minus lin 4. so again remember because we've not simplified this, we still need to get, simplify this and get rid of this minus. So we recall, recall that uh, if you have a raised to power minus b, so this is equals like I said, being a negative index. So we turn this to minus one divided. We turn minus to one divided by then we have a divided by b. So if you apply this to this, we will have y equals this minus will become one divided by and you write this exponential we have exponential the lampant function minus lin 4 so we have it like this and uh, you can you can have to check this so the lampant function of this so to uh, maybe with uh wolfram alpha Python uh, upgraded scientific calculator, but when I do that, so I see that uh, the the exact value of this didn't exist. So and therefore, you can actually declare this that this your answer. So if you are solving a question, maybe giving an Olympiad exam or other exam or whatever exam you are writing, so you can actually leave your answer like this and uh, see that uh, this. You can have exact uh, exact value. So this will be your answer. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you can like and leave a comment, and don't forget to share with your friends and network. Do well to also subscribe to my channel to stay updated on my next video. Bye.